two, four. It's this one. Five, four. <laughs> Welcome back, back to Metal Rolls TV, where the underground meets the playground. Uh, I'm Jeremy from the Chamonix Creek. I'm Jeff Rappaport. And I'm Mighty Matt Gibbons. All right, so in the news, Cauldron of Doom has released its third album. Wow. It's going to release the third album, Tomorrow is Lost, on April 30th via okay, Century Media. It. Earache. Why are you going to find it? No, just Tomorrow is Lost. Oh. Come on, seriously? <laughs> That's a bad joke. That's one of my better ones. Actually. He keeps throwing them until they stick. You ever watch like Tosh.0? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> you know how that guy... You know how he just keeps throwing he he keeps throwing yeah. jokes until he's stick. Yeah, because right? he's fucking not funny. <laughs> Sometimes <laughs> he is. I think he's ah, I don't like Tosh. He hits on about one out of every eight. See, that's not funny. Yeah. Not really. I think he hits more often than that. You right? think? But then again, I tell terrible jokes, so. But there's a lot though. When, when you watch a show, have you just... seen the Jeselnik offensive? That's the, the show you have to watch. Anthony Jeselnik has a show. I have no idea about that. Like, he's yeah. really funny. No <laughs> fucking show you darling. He just... His like his my favorite joke of his. You have I'm... too much TV time. Does this violate? Uh, copyright law if I tell my favorite joke of his but I, I'm crediting him with telling it Anthony Jeselnik I don't he's think like I, I used to it. watch the, the Brady Bunch and I I felt that I had a lot of common with him because my dad died of AIDS too <laughs> <laughs> that is good I don't get that one that's a good joke uh, the father of the Brady Bunch actually died of AIDS he did? yeah, yeah. I didn't know in that in real life yeah. for real stop Robert Reed is that what it is? I don't know fucking news to me yeah. <laughs> true story was gay the father of the Brady Bunch really he liked the pain and died but, of AIDS you know that doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get AIDS, but he, yeah. he had the AIDS, the real shit. Yep. So it was magic. How the fuck is he still alive? They were talking about that. They, they think that he has like a secret drug that... that he definitely does. Did you see the South Park episode? They decided yeah, 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 yeah. close proximity to large amounts of cash was the cure to... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I stopped watching it ever since that Terrence and Felton. Yeah, that, that you, was that. Your, you were out. That was my out. You were like, I got out. Rappaport, out. My friend died, and I went to, a, I went to his funeral, and I came home, and I'm like... I need to be cheered up. And it was that Terrence and Phelps episode where we were supposed that, to it reveal South Park. father. Yeah, it was just all it was was Terrence and Phelps episode. And I'm like, I can't watch this anymore. I'm done with the show. <laughs> it ruined it. I'm like, you, I needed you today, South Park, and you let me down. I will never watch you again. Tarrats. True story. Mm -hmm. And you never look back. I haven't And that back. was like the second season, so you missed a lot of South Park. Yeah, I guess I did. <laughs> you saw the twat. So, what do you think of Cauldron? I have mixed feelings about Cauldron. I understand what they're doing. It's kind of like, you know, there's the, the, the glut of um, new thrash bands that kind of try and recapture the Spread 80s, like the Hatchets, right. the, the Bonded by Bloods, who I right. like actually a lot. Um, they're kind of trying to throw back to before that to sort of made any kind of metal. Of yeah, they're a new wave of British heavy metal kind Hell, of stuff. Yeah, Hell yeah. metal. Yeah. And that's cool. You know, that's a, that's a new that's a, their own thing, and I liked it. And I, like, I saw one video of theirs, I can't remember the name of it, but the... The theme of the video was like this couple was out on a date and they were being chased through the forest, but it, it took forever for the song to start. So work on that, guys. Get an editor, something, cut the, the video time down. Um, so the vocals, to me, were not quite there. No. Something was going on with the vocals that, something was amiss that I didn't quite like. And the name, to me, the name, for some reason, I kind of thought they would be a doomish kind of band. Like it is kind of a doomish band. Yeah. Name, yeah. But they were definitely like more power classic metal, like kind of. But I, I kind of liked it enough that I might check out more of it, but the, the vocals were not quite what I would want them to be. All right. Well, I actually heard Tomorrow's Lost. Ooh, okay. The entire wow. album is on YouTube. Ooh. So I actually heard the entire album, and uh, I'm not into it at all. Really? I, I tried to listen to it. And that's your kind of jam, that music. It lacks an energy, I thought. And I thought, and, and it kind of soul-sucking. Oh. Wow, that's yeah. pretty... <laughs> the, pretty, the, solos, pretty harsh words. the solos seem very calculated, like almost like they're like, okay. The guitar solos, you mean? Yeah, they're like, here you go. I, you know, I don't know like music terms, but kind of like fast, 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 slow, okay, stop. Like it just sounded like somebody, like somebody just learned to play a solo. I was going to say, it's very formulaic. Yeah, they laid it in. Well, you know, if they're... Not very free. I mean, if they're, if they're I don't want to say trying to be like a certain, you know, if they're trying to be like, maybe Maiden has a formula. Yeah. Kinda like... And I don't want to say they necessarily have a phone reader, but they have. It's a very. It's it's sort of like when a band's been doing something for so long, and you describe them and like, oh, that's very maiden esque, you know. Like, right. That's, it's, that's definitely true. You know, it's it's something you would expect from that band, and I mean, so sometimes you can see it as one of those things. It's it's sort of like that galloping bass. You know, yeah. 
that you, you expect a maiden. When you, hear band, when you hear bands do that nowadays, you're kind of like, oh, a maiden's done that. Yeah. Right? Like, he, these guys were like, it's like, um, I can see what they're trying to do. Yes. But the vocals are definitely, I think that's definitely. That's the weak point, right? Definitely. The, it really drags it down. The, because the, the vocals are not good I'm at all. I'm sorry. I wanted to like you guys too. I apologize. I wanted to like you too. There are if you guys are watching this, I'm sorry about that. They're a trio and they're from Canada. And I thought this would be kind of cool. And I thought, like, I thought I'd heard them before, but I, I don't remember it being, unless it, What is it about trios from Canada? Mm. I don't know. I think <laughs> Russian <laughs> triumph vocals. are much better. Yes. <laughs> you know? Is yeah. triumph a trio? They're a trio, right? Yeah. yeah they're much I, better. I gotta tell you what, man. Three pieces are the shit. Lay it on the yeah. grind. Sorry. Lay it on the grind. Just taking a pun. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I was just really, like, I was saddened by this because I thought it was gonna be good. I'm like, yeah, so let me try know. and get into it more. I really, I really, I listened to the entire album. I regret that I don't like it more. There was like moments where I was like, okay, this is kind of good, and the vocals come in, it's just like, the vocals were kind of like, this reminded me of like, hey guys, we're Cauldron, and we're going to play some metal for you. So I just thought they were like a little too high, like for what they should be. He only went high every once in a while, though. Well, I'm, I'm basing this on one song that I heard that may not have been oh. on the album, so we might be... Most times it's just he's Maybe he took the advice I'm giving. The song it, probably it, wasn't on yeah, the yeah. record, but you know, it's yeah. a song I heard. So he fuck you he sang a lot of monotone. It was just like, kind of like, this is not good. Huh. Like, I can imagine people being at the concert and everybody like, just being like... Titties. You know, like, this, like, you'd have to be really drunk and like, they have to be like your buddies to really like it. <laughs> oh, man. That's a shame. You know what I mean? Friends just, first, sorry, fans guys. second, man. I actually yeah. feel bad about not liking it. Okay, I, I wanted bad. to like it, believe me. This I, is the first time I ever felt bad about giving a bad review. I don't feel bad about not listening to the band at all. <laughs> believe it or not, wait, believe it or not... <laughs> I, when I go in for listening to a band, I really I go in wanting to like a band because listen, if I go in and tell you that the band's great and give you a great review, the band's more likely to put it up on their website and pimp it and get me more views. So I, I in 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 a way, I want to like the band because I'd like I'd like to get you know it's good for both of us. Yeah, yeah. But but the honest part of me is is no, comes I mean, out and I don't. Well, not that it shows yeah. your journalistic integrity. Yeah, and so I so. I go in liking it. You, you you've won me over immediately, and then you then you lose me, basically. And I'm unfortunately, kind of I'm really just stop playing music. Be honest. Yeah. Kill yourselves <laughs> and start brewing beer. Just keep, yeah. just keep pay, playing be, um, playing for your friends because don't pretend they like it. And play for yourself. That's all that matters. Fuck everyone else. I just, uh, but, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, what do you say? All right. Sorry, guys. I really am. That's what we have on Cauldron. Sorry, Someday. Guys. Sorry to listen to your record. <laughs> I will probably sample it again. I'm actually probably going to listen to it after I get home now. I'm probably like, this guys are crazy. This shit's great. <laughs> I, need, I need to re-edit on that shit. It's listen. not horrible. It's not horrible. No. It, so when you, when you go home, you should do this. Like, when I put this video up, so I'll be tagging you and everything in it, and you, you'll be on there. I, you can go in there and listen to You can go up and look. You, oh, yeah. You'll be reminded about it, and you look it up. And then in the comments, you can be like... Fuck those guys. They were wrong. I should have listened to this first. I loved it. Or whatever you say. We want to see your comments. Or you're totally right. It blows down. All right. So I guess this we have in Colton. Good luck, guys. I, I'm, I feel bad. I want to like it.